YouTube fam, what's going on? It's your boy Dylan Flex. Guys, have an exciting video today. For the new subscribers that I have, we do a lot of teaching beginners how to resell. I make it easy for you guys to get inventory. For the new subscribers out there or for the people just watching now, make sure you smash that subscribe button. I have an exciting video for you today. We're gonna go see one of my good friends, Classic Kenny. It's gonna be how to make more money selling your sneakers. Wait, I can make more money? Yes, you can make more money. I'm gonna show you guys now exactly what I mean. Right here, as you guys can see, we have a 2011 white cement, right? Shoe looks beat, right? Even the other one. I'm gonna bring it to my guy, Classic Kenny, and I'm gonna show you guys exactly what I mean, how you can make more money selling shoes, right? And why sometimes buying used is actually more beneficial. But take a good look at these now because my boy Classic Kenny is gonna make these look insane and make it easier for me to sell. So I just pulled up to Classic Kenny's house now, and this is a reason why I love to go to Kenny's house. If you've guys seen my last video, He's the classic king. I'm gonna go to the wife's side in a second, but this is just the classic side. We gotta get the lights going in here. Yeah, I'm just giving him a little preview, Kenny. Just something light, just so they can get a little taste of it. I'm with my main man, classic Kenny, my guy. I'm just oh chilling like a villain. About to clean up your Jordan 3s that are completely thrashed. You think you're gonna make these come back to life? I was trying to tell them before I got here. I'm gonna sell this pair and this is an easy way to oh make God. more money. Right? Show them how thrashed they are. I was show I just took the laces out right now, guys. Oh Let me get a look. God damn, you guys, look at this. I just took the laces out, here you go. Oh, look at all these scuffs around the soles, man. What are they, you doing, Dad? Things are clapped, bro. This, this was a pair that I invested in that I wow. bought low. That I'm gonna sell for hire, but I wanted to show and share with them an easy way to get more money reselling your shoes. You think you could bring these back to life, Kenny? I do. I think I know I can, and that's why I'm gonna make you guys believe within the product if you don't already. EB Kick Shoe Cleaner Conditioner, baby. You're gonna wet the brush with a little bit of the tap. Yes, I said it. The tap doesn't have to be a special water, and. Use cold water, you don't have to use hot water. Just, just to let you guys know that. See the suds, once you start seeing it sud, that's how you know it works. Look how it just ripped through all those supposedly hard dirt scuff stains. That, yes, and they were hard. If you had a normal soap and water, if you had uh, you know, your shoe cleaner from around the way, but considering that if you have the most exclusive cleaner on the market, and it, it, up to me, honestly, on the planet, then it, of course it makes a hard job look very easy. They're coming back to life. This, this is, is crazy simple. already. Just look at it's it. It's because it's EB. Push it down, it starts to fill the sponge up. Now the purpose of this is to fill the stitching. So watch this. You see how the stitching looks right here? Man, these are nice now. Now look. Remember when they used to look like that? Jeez. See, and you don't have to squeeze the bottle. Just go around it just like this. And the best part about this product is, if it gets on anything else that's not white, it will wipe right off. You see how I have to go over the lace locks, this whole area, to get the stitching. I'm gonna show you the difference right now. So this is obviously the clean pair that looked like this, right? So and we, and we didn't even hit the bottoms of the shoe yet, like the actual, Bottom, bottom of the shoe. Not even. This is literally night and day. So when people ask me, Dylan, what are some tips and tricks you have when it comes to used sneakers? Guys, I automatically use EB Kicks, right? That's just a fact. It's my secret weapon when I come to cleaning shoes. Also, when the shoes are beat and they're dirty, I don't buy beat, but if I see a good price when it comes to used sneakers, I'm not afraid to buy them because I know that I can use this and bring them back to life and make more money. This is EB side of the wall before I left the house. That's why I like coming over to the house. She got a couple gems over here for all you people asking. What size is she, Kenny? She's five, six. So if you're a five or six, you're probably in heaven right here. It's also cool to see a lot of these shoes. Not to mention, I think they look sick in these sizes. Kenny, I appreciate you getting me right, man. These shoes are popping. I'm going to be able to post them now for a good price. That's how we do it. Thank you, sir. I know it's hot as hell in this garage. It's a heat warning in Vegas. <laughs> I'm going to let you do your thing. Yes, sir. It sure is. Shout out Classic Kenny, my guy. Thank you. Yes. So I wanted to give a big shout out to my guy, Classic Kenny, man, for getting me right. And shout out to EB Kicks. So I wanted to show you guys. Yeah, these are way better. 
way, way, way better. I wanted to show you guys and share with you, because I get a lot of questions and I get a lot of DMs, especially lately, on what shoes should I buy if I have X amount, $200, $300, right? What should I do? I don't think it's bad if you buy you shoes, if that's your price point. I also don't think it's bad if you buy you shoes, if it's not, right? If you can clean up the shoes and it's not completely beat, there's always a way to sell them, right? See, the thing about shoes are, is, is what price do you pay, right? I paid ridiculously low for these because I knew that number one, they're beat, I'm gonna have to clean them, but also, if I do clean them, I know I'm gonna be able to sell them. So that's a tip and trick that I have for you guys. I said, don't buy beat shoes, but it's okay to buy you shoes. And that's a DM that I've been getting a lot too on what product should I buy. Well guys, Jordans are always a classic, right? This is a 2011, this is the white cement. I knew that this was gonna be good. This is also a really good mystery box shoe too that you guys can get for cheap and that you can sell yourself. So I wanted to show you guys that it's that easy to make more money on reselling sneakers. This is stuff that I don't really get to see people posting, right? This isn't buyouts, this is tips for you guys so you can make more money. A lot of beginners and a lot of people don't know this so I'm happy that I can share with you guys. So one of the number one questions I've been getting asked on Capital Vegas, because I did post this, is when are you gonna do a steals group and what is a steal group? All right guys, the cat's out of the bag now, right? I said that I'm gonna do a steal group and I absolutely mean it. What this is gonna mean is that the resellers that wanna get more product and wanna get product for cheap, this is your chance. For the people who just want to get the product for way cheap, this is also your chance. It's a win-win. I know there's a lot of resellers, a lot of stores, a lot of people that I sell to that want to make money, that want to get inventory and sell it themselves. This is something that's gonna be crazy for you guys. You're gonna be able to make an extreme profit, and I'm gonna tell you guys more details soon. It's gonna be extremely limited, and I'm gonna make it so mystery boxes, and you know the steals on Capital Vegas, you think those are crazy now? Just wait till the actual still group happens. Like I said, I don't wanna to talk too much about that. I just wanted to inform you guys about another tip and trick that I have to make and help you guys make more money because that's what I'm about. I'm here to help you guys. No one showed me the ropes. This is stuff that I had to learn the hard way or sometimes the easy way, but now it's easier and faster ways to make money for you guys, especially now with mystery boxes in the steel group. Like I said, guys, thank you for all the love and the support. Make sure you guys stay tuned to Capital Vegas. You never know what you guys might see on there. Man, I just wanna go fast. Hold on my teeth and on my head.